Hi everyone, Abby here. Welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. Today I'm gonna to be reviewing the new or relatively new Lululemon Align V Waist Pant 25 inch. But before I get started, make sure to hit that subscribe button if you're not already subscribed so you can stay tuned to all my new videos dropping weekly and so you can help the channel grow. So I have this in the color graphite gray in a size 10 and it currently goes for $128. So we have that V-shaped waist and we also have a V-shape at the front right here. So at the back we can see the logo is right here. We have that traditional Lululemon Silver logo. And now I'm gonna go ahead and try this on so you can see what it looks like on me. And all right guys, this is what they look like on me. The Align V-waist pant, 25 inch. Once again, I am wearing these in a size 10. So I am five foot eight and just wanted to point out that they are a little bit too short on me by about an inch or so. So depending on your height, it may or may not work for you. The Align V-Waist does not come in a 28 inch. You just have to go with either the 25 inch or the 23. One thing about the V-Waist is that, you know, obviously you don't really notice it when you're wearing a longer shirt. So I'm wearing this with a crop shirt. You can't see the waist. <laughs> so you really have to wear this with like super duper cropped items to even see the V-Waist at all. So here it is with my shirt a little bit raised so you can see the waist a bit better. All right guys, so for my size and recommendation here, I would recommend staying true to size. Now, if you're talking about the regular line pants, they don't fit the same in my opinion. The waistband on these is a lot looser and because of this V design, um, it does show your stomach a lot more than the other one. So if you do want to size down, you can give that a shot but I personally don't size down on my lines because in the past they bagged out on me, stretched out when I done that, so I just stay true to size here. So now I'm gonna go to the major feature highlights about these leggings. So they're great for yoga, casual wear, and other low intensity activities. They're made of Lululemon's and Nulu fabric, which is lightweight, buttery soft, it has four way stretch, it's sweat wicking, it has a slim tight naked sensation fit, it has a lightweight warmth, so it's great to wear in all seasons, it has a high rise fit, a V waist, and we have one pocket at the back. The V waist here is not as accentuated, not as much of a V on me as it is on the model right here. So obviously we do have different body types here. So depending on your body type, it might be more or less of a V on you. Another thing I wanted to know is that although it's high waisted, the front is not as high waisted as the back. I have the Z Flip 4. I can fit my entire phone in this pocket. It does stick out, doesn't look cute, but hey, it fits in there. <laughs> if you do have a regular phone, like a slab phone, it will not fit in here. Other than that, you can fit in some credit cards, some keys, little things like that. So the Align V-Waist here does differ from the regular Align pants in that it does not have a waist pocket right here in the hip. It instead just has one pocket at the back. So this is a drop-in pocket. I'm wearing a pair of Align pants right now. We have a pocket in the waist. So it's right here. So here is the Align pant, the regular version. I'm wearing these in a 28 inch inseam. So a couple of things that I've noticed different, obviously the waistband here, and it's a lot higher. So the high rise here is actually really high rise. When it comes to these pants, unfortunately, there's a lot more cons for me than there are pros. A couple of pros I have are the fabric is soft and these are comfortable to like lounge in. And I do like the color as well. I think the graphite gray here is really nice. The first con for me is the fit. The fit for me is just off. Because the waistband is loose, I find that to be an issue because I have to constantly be pulling them up and adjusting them. If I sit and stand up, if I take a few steps even, the waistband falls down. You guys just saw it was right up here. It fell down in a few steps. So the waistband for me, definitely a no-go. Does not fit my body type well. And in addition to that, it does not look like a V on me. Like, look at the model here and look at me. Like, it does not fit the same <laughs> on us at all. It's funny because people say that the Align V here is supposed to be more flattering than the regular Align pant because of the V shape, but I don't find that. That being said, I know a lot of people do like this V design because it can give you, I guess, like an illusion of a slimmer waist, but I have a stomach. I don't have washboard abs, and I find that it accentuates my stomach, this V shape around here. Like, it makes my stomach look bigger, I feel like, than when I wear regular line pants with the straight waist, so. I don't find it super flattering on myself. That's not my style, <laughs> but you guys might really like it. It really depends on your personal preference. Another con for me is it's very low coverage. So, so you see cellulite very easily. You see panty lines very easily. There's also this like pocket um, lines at the back, which I do not like the appearance of that you see as well. So I definitely find that to be an issue. 
you may or not care about those things, but I don't like a bunch of lines just on my lines. <laughs> Another con for me is the price. Of course, the price. These are $128. The regular align pant goes for $98. Why are we paying almost $30 more just for a V? Like, I do not understand. So I definitely don't like the pay bump up between here to here. And the last con for me, which is this con with the regular line pants as well, they attract pet hair and lint very, very easily. So you're gonna have to constantly lint roll them brush them down to make sure that they're looking good. I know a couple of you requested that I review these leggings, so I hope you do find this helpful. And all right guys, considering the price, the quality, the color, the fit, the comfort, the functionality, and everything like that, I would go ahead and give these a 6.4 out of 10. And I do give them a thumbs up. Now, these leggings are not for me. I'm not a huge fan of the fit here, so these leggings are definitely going back for that reason alone. They do not work well for my body type. However, they may work out for you. If you're interested in picking up the Align v waist here, I've gone ahead and left a link down in the description for you to use. I also have a link there for the regular Align pants if you wanna check those out instead. Also, if you're interested in learning a bit more about the Align pant here and you wanna see what different lengths look like on me because they do come in different lengths. These are 28 inches. You can find a video of where I try on three different lengths of Align pants at the top right or in the description below. And that's all I have for today. Thanks for watching and make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye.